It's a great little device that takes a USB mouse and keyboard and enables them to work with Bluetooth devices like an iPad or an Android. I get a lot of questions on the reviews I've done on different um, keyboards. Will this work with Bluetooth? And usually they do not. Well, now this will allow it to work. So I'm gonna do a little unboxing here and then we'll come back with a full testing of it and give you an idea how it works. Um, very easy to open, straightforward, beautiful little box. Where you can see right there is the device on the right. Let's pop this out. Definitely in there snugly, which is nice so it doesn't get damaged. Very, very small, which I like. Palm of my hand and I do not have big hands, so that's nice. Um, on off, a little indicator there for paired. Oh, micro USB cable, probably for charging, and USB inputs on both sides, so you could do um, two different devices coming in. So that's really nice there. All right, here is a nice little USB charging cable, very long. Um, I'm guessing eyeballing that, about six foot cable, which is really nice. And then a little instruction manual here. So pretty basic, there's not a lot to explain with it, but nice little instructions, nice to see them take some time to write out instructions and not just saying go to their website. So I've been impressed with it. I like the layout, the design, I mean, even the box looks beautiful. Um, and feels good, it's light, super light. Takes two, it looks like uh, AAA batteries in there and then you can control it on off here. So throw this in your pocket, throw this in your backpack. If you wanna go do writing, I have to do a lot of writing on my job now. And uh, you know, sometimes it'd be nicer just to take my Nexus 7 tablet and have a full keyboard with it to pound out a few reviews. So I'm excited to test this out. Well, I'll come back with a full review of it. If you have any questions, let me know. So I've tested this out for a while and I've been very impressed. The setup was super simple. I just connected it via Bluetooth once I plugged it in, and it worked. Uh, it gives you a little code to type in on the keyboard, hit enter, and you're connected. The, um, it does take two double or triple A's, excuse me, batteries, and it ran for about six hours. I was very impressed with that. The um, keyboards work great. Now, when you plug the keyboards into the device and turn it on, wait about 10 seconds, because it takes a little bit longer for the keyboard to actually power on. So don't let that worry you. Um, and it takes pretty much any keyboard I've used. I've used an old Dell keyboard and this Logitech keyboard works great, no issues. Well, let's zoom in here and um, check out some test, um, typing on it. Now, with my job, I do a lot of typing now and the ability to be on the road, get some breaking information and have to quickly pound something out, to have a full keyboard with me is great. It works, all the functions work on it. Um, it just does everything. Uh, the uh, caps lock, all of that works, no issues at all. The uh, keypad on it works great. Numbers lock does everything you would expect it to. Now I'm scrolling around with the numbers pad. So smooth, easy, simple, does exactly what it says. There really is not a lot to go into here because it just works. I've used it with several um, different apps, Facebook, Hangouts, um, here's Google Docs, uh, spreadsheets, it just works. Anywhere a keyboard's needed, it will do it. So I've been very impressed. Um, as you can see, I'm typing here and it's coming up on the screen. So highly recommend it. Um, it's nice and small, fits into the palm of my hand, and it works off of batteries and it works off of the wall outlet. So it really is up to you. Again, uh, I got maybe about six hours of battery life on it before I stopped testing it. Um, I never was able to completely exhaust it during my testing phase. But if you're going to be using it in the home for an extended period of time, I highly recommend plugging it in the wall. If you're using Connect to a, a computer that takes Bluetooth, uh, Android device, so forth, um, this will be probably the best idea is plug in the wall, save yourself some money of keep buying batteries. And they include a very nice six foot cable with it, so it works great. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them at the um, uh, either on our YouTube account or on cordcuttersnews.com on our posts about it, and I'll do my best to answer them. Thank you for watching the video, and please subscribe.